What I would like to, to share with, with you is, a, for in my opinion, a very interesting history why the first attempt to professionalization psychology in Argentina failed. Not only failed, uh, I guess it was censored, it, uh, it, it was uh, in, in, in future history of psychology in my country. Well, you, you know very well this map, but I only try to, to, to remark that one of the main topics in political science, in newspaper, in economy, in Argentina is how to put Argentina into the map. It is not easy. We are falling the map, as, as you know. Of course, there are new maps uh, uh, since the epistemologies of, of South and so on, but we are very far from, from any part of, of the world. Well, I try to periodize uh, psychology in Argentina. I try to uh, distinguish five uh, periods. Our, our history will be in the second and third, per, uh, excuse me, third and fourth period. In the third, when the first attempt failed, and in the fourth period, when they uh, established the professionalization of psychology. Well, psychology began in, Ar in, in Argentina not as a profession, but as a, 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 a science to help a physicians, a lawyers, educators. Excuse me sir, if, if, if I if I share with you this uh, state of Binet, because in the next uh, diapositive, I, I, I will compare with the, uh, uh, what uh, wrote Pinheiro, one of the main physicians in Argentina, that in the first part co almost copy this statement. For about 15 years, psychology has entered into a new era. This era dates from about 1878, a time that is doubly important for psychology, since it was there when, in Germany, Mr. Wundt established the first laboratory of experimental psychology, and when, in France, Mr. Charcot inaugurated his research on hypnotics and hysterics. At about the same time, Monsieur Ribot found, founded the Rebou Philosophique and gave a lively impulse for the studies of experimental psychology in France. Uh, this, this, this attempt to explain the, the bore of the new psychology uh, differ what is tradition in the American historiography, North American historiography of psychology, that psychology began with the establishment of the new, uh, of the first laboratory of experimental psychology. And since now, what, what, uh, what say, what wrote uh, Horacio Pinheiro, Two facts of paramount importance definitely indicate their course in 1878. Charcot and his studies on hysteria and hypnotis, and Bund founded in Leipzig the first experimental psychology laboratory. If we add to these facts that report forms the Rebou philosophique at the same time, we can say that from this trio emerges clinical observation, experimental research, and scientific divulgation. If we, if we uh, stay with the first part, it's almost a copy, and then Pinheiro add this idea of, of a trio. So, the reception of new psychology in Argentina is uh, emphasized three, uh, three lines of psychology and three main uh, authors clinical observation, experimental research, and scientific in, in, uh, divulgation. The problem is that uh, in Argentina, in those years, people interested in psychology, lawyers, educators, uh, medical doctors, didn't read in Germany. So, when they receive Wundt ideas, they receive Wundt ideas through French translation or through uh, um, divulgations books. For instance, the well-known book by, uh, by Ribot, The uh, Psychologie Allemande Contemporaine. So, what truly grew up in Argentina at the, first of, uh, uh, at the end of 19th century and, and, and the first decade of 20th century was French psychology, mainly clinical French psychology, mainly the, what I call the disaggregation, the psychology of the segregation of personality. Not only the work of, of Charcot or, or Jeanette, but also the work of Grasset. Joseph Grasset from a school of Montpellier may be uh, a person uh, forgotten in the history of psychology, but very important in many countries of Latin America, especially in Argentina. 
Well, when beginning the, 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 the profession of psychology, uh, in the, uh, as I in the third period, as we know, the period of psychology as psychotechnics and professional guidance. Uh, see there, uh, uh, the, the, the economy grew up a lot since uh, mi uh, between uh, uh, 1930 and 1945 and 1949. Uh, uh, for instance, you can, you can say, if you say the number of establishments uh, near, uh, near 60,000 for 150,000 in 1944, the same the number of workers, the, the, the workers, per uh, uh, pardon, the, the install hard uh, power. Uh, so, uh, economy grew up in those years. Take into account that there no exist in Argentina up to those years a lot of uh, workers, of, of qualified workers for this, uh, this uh, increase and, and grow up of economy. Well, the federal administration, the, the, the national government, established a five years uh, planning. And, and, and let me you, uh, to, to share with you uh, some, some ideas uh, where they, in this five years plan, uh, appears the psychotechnics and the professional guidance. The, the second five plan uh, established the objective of promoting learning and professional guidance in the field of education and work. In the field of work, it was established that the social and e economic policy of the administration should be based, based on a lot of conditions. Among them, establishment of rational correlation between the skills, aptitude in Spanish, of the worker and his occupation in order to obtain the highest indexes of productivity and of remuneration. And in 1949 was reformed the constitution and in the new constitution appeared a new right, new right for the workers, family, uh, young people and anciency, and established the professional guidance of young people conceived as a complement to the action of learning and educating is a social function that the administration protects and fosters through institutions that guide young people towards the activity for which they possess natural aptitudes and capacity, with the purpose that the correct professional election affects both their benefits and that of the society as a whole. Well, in such a... Uh, uh, in, in but first, what is the meaning of psychotechnics? Because it's a very, 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 very strange uh, world around 1950. I use uh, Henri Pierron this is the first, what, what you have there is the first book of the Traité of Psychology uh, uh, Appliqué. The, the first book is, is entitled La Psychologie Differentielle and, 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 and Pierron State. He will say that psychotechnics is the discipline that govern, governs the application of the data of psychophysiology to human problems through the use of a set of rigorously scientific methods and mainly of psychometric methods. Psychotechnics was at the same time an application of, 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 of such uh, science and the discipline that, uh, that is on the base of such application. But it's important that for Piron, psychotechn psychotechnician is not always an applied psychology. It's interesting to, 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 to keep in mind uh, that question. And what is the meaning of professional guidance? This is, this is the first book in the collection entitled uh, Science of Education from the editorial Capellus. Uh, it was wrote by the Catalan, uh, Catalan physician who, is who, 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 who established in Argentina, Emilio Mirai López. Emilio Mirai López was the the chief of this of the psychiatric uh, section in this uh, for for the republic for the republic uh, of spanish in the civil war he established of course after the war in, in other countries and according to Mireille Lopez, the concept of professional guidance means a complex and persistent scientific action with the aim of achieving that each people fit the type of professional work in which, with less effort, he can obtain greater performance, profit, and satisfaction for themselves and for the so society. What is interesting in the, in the perspective of Mireille Lopez that he distinguishes between the individual professional guidance and the collective uh, one. 
the individually is a psychosocial process that is from an individual uh, who has uh, he or she doubt about her her future her work her her uh, his or her uh, studies but the collective uh, uh, professional guidance is only that could be established by a, s a centered uh, administration or at least a planned administration. Well, and which are the technical and the scientific support for psychotechnics? I will, I will share only the w uh, what impact in Argentina are the French tradition and the Catalan tradition. Uh, in Argentina uh, has not uh, 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 many importance the German tradition or the American tradition. Well, first of all, o o o first of all the, the entry in the Encyclopédie Française, la, la Psychotechnique, from Piron. Piron, we, we recently saw that book, the first book of the Traité de Psychologie Experimentale, Spanish translation by Editorial eh, Capeluz. Eh, Paul Fres, the Manual Pratique eh, de Psychologie Experimentale, Tra a translation into Spanish uh, four years later, Manual Práctico de Psicología Experimental, Gui Padmal, La Psicotecnique, translated very, very, uh, uh, very years uh, 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 after by Editorial Paidós. Uh, and then the Catalan tradition. Uh, Klaus Severg is not very well known, he's a psychotechnician who established in his Belgian, he's a Belgian psycho psychotechnician, he established in Barcelona, he worked into the Institute of Professional Guidance that established Mira y López, and he wrote for uh, uh, three books uh, for, edit for labor uh, publishing house. There, there were not translation. He, he published original in, original in, in, in Spanish, then it was translated into, into French. And the last one, the, the, the work, the, the, the book of Mira y López. Well, in such a con in context, so appear the first three undergraduate programs, las primeras carreras in the field of psychology, but they didn't label psychology. In 1950 was the bachelor degree in psychotechnics and professional guidance in the National University of Tucumán. In 1953, university assistant auxiliar in psychotechnics as a higher technical degree in the University of Litoral, but in the city of Rosario. And in, night, in the same year, university specialization in psychology, uh, university, National University of Cuyo, but in San Luis City. Although it is labeled in, this is the only one that is labeled in psychology, but the objective was to train the staff of the administration of educational psychology and professional guidance, a, 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 a office that depends simultaneously uh, of the province, the, the provincial administration and of the university. Well, here is the, the first, the first of, of this uh, a, a program in psychology, the bachelor degree in, in Tucumán. The director was uh, Benjamin Aybar, a philosopher. Benjamin Aybar was a philosopher who wrote a very well-known book, uh, uh, El Realismo Intuitivo, The Intuitive Realist, and he stated, adaptation of the tools to the worker and the worker to the tools, a skills and qualification more consistent with the various crafts, appropriate work places, motivation, incentive, etc. This is maybe the more the, 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 the more approach near to Taylorist and to American psychotechnics. But nevertheless, uh, Aybar was a, a Thomist, a Thomist philosopher, and he stated that when each people find the adequate or the appropriate uh, work, they 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 grew in his or her essay dad. They say that is, is, a, is an Augustinian word. In fact, it is not a Thomist, but it's the idea that the, the to, to fit the worker to the to the appropriate uh, place is not only is not, not only question of of, 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 of well managed of the word. It's only something to the identity and the and, and the and the and, and, and for the grow of each person. Well. Uh, Aybar was established previous the Institute of Psychotechnics and Professional Guidance, whose objective were the development of the Huber factor and the study of workers' work. 
Well, in 1953, in the University of Litoral, in the city of Rosario, uh, appeared the auxiliar the university assistant in psychotechnics. Carl, one of the, of the main uh, advisors of the program was uh, Karl Haus. He born in Dusseldorf. He established in Argentina since 1913. And he returned to Germany after the uh, German Congress of Psychology in 1934. Uh, and he established definitively in 1935. Of course, uh, he, he wrote about the importance of the new uh, Germany. And of course, he agreed in some, in some, in some, extent, uh, in, in some uh, sense of the world with the, with the Nazi idea. So he established until in, in, in Germany until 1945. He returned to Argentina in 1945, and he went to Tucumán, and he was one of the advisors of this program. It's interesting. Uh, Hessinghaus uh, compared the, 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 the place of the psychotechnician with the place of the engineer. They say, uh, uh, relate to the material facts of the, of the industry, uh, the engineer, especially the security engineer, uh, must play an important role. But relate to the human factors of the work, there must be a psychotechnician who can help to the manage of the enterprise. It's, 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 it's quite an, an, an rare expression, uh, even in, in those au in, in the authors, in the authors of, of those years. In 1973, this is my province. This is where uh, I live. San Luis is a very small, is one of the smallest uh, province of the, of the country. As you see, we are, we are uh, uh, near, near Chile m uh, than Buenos Aires. In 1953, uh, uh, was established the University Specialization in Psychology. He, among the foundations of the program, it was mentioned the relationship between psychology education and the objective of the second five-year plan. The program was organized to train the staff of the administration of educational psychology on professional uh, guidance. I would like to, this is, this is the program it's interesting because uh, it's similar of, 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 of any program in psychology in nowadays, a small maybe, but uh, for instance, a bachelor in science with a major in psychology is not very different of this. First, uh, you, you see first year anatomy and physiology, psychology one, psychology two, psychology of the child and the adolescent. Second year, notions of psychopathology, juridic psychology, social psychology, notions of mathematics applied to psychology. And in third year, applied psychology one, general problems, notions of psychometrics, critical study of tests applies to students. Applied psychology do, uh, to school counseling and professional guidance, professional selection, psychotechnical in general with notion of its application to the industry. And applied psychology three, notion of biotypology and anthropometry, differential psychology and characterology study methods. I would like to, 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 to repeat the, the, the part of the clinical, uh, cr critical study of test applied to students. Again, it was not an, a tailorist program. The idea of critical Placidoras was, again, he was, uh, his degree was in philosophy at Buenos Aires University. He became a psychologist, a practical. He, he was psychology, psychology for, for, for his work, not for his, uh, his education. And he was so critical of the uh, Taylorist uh, program. Well, what happened with those programs? In 1940, uh, in, in 1954, excuse me, uh, held the first Argen Argen Argentine Congress of Psychology in Tucumán, and one of the commissions recommended the first Argentine Congress of Psychology declares the need to create a university program for professional psychologists, not for psychology, for professional psychologists, in accordance with the following conditions. So, this is not recommended a program in psychotechnics or professional guidance. It recommended a program in psychology. And from 1955, the new uh, psychology uh, under the program began to be organized now by the name of psychology. These are 
<coughs> the first, uh, I, if I remember, for 14 programs in psychology, six in national university, six in private university, and two in, profi in provincial university. Nowadays, th th there are no, uh, there are only two uh, professional uh, pr provincial university, but in those days there are a, a lot. So there was program in psychology. There was no program in psychotechnics, nor in, 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 or in, or in, uh, in professional uh, guidance. Well, what, what is in interesting to, to analyze of the old programs in, in, in psychotechnics and, and, uh, and professional guidance and the fail of the constitution of the profession in such field? It's important to associate that with the new historiography uh, in, in the last uh, 20 years because uh, in the last 20 years appeared a new uh, historiography related to studies in Peronismo e e in Peronist years. While up to 1990s, historiographical interpretations of Peronists repro reproduced political positions, in the last years a more precise analysis of the primary sources was privileged and Peronists was incorporated into the op topics of academic historiography. So in the intersection of the social history of psychology and psychotechnics and that of the, the new historiography of Peronis, especially the new of, of the planning state, it's possible to analyze what happened with, uh, wh why uh, such a, a, a attempt uh, failed. Oh. Well, fundamental contradictions in the emergence of psychology programs in Argentina. First, psychology programs were conceived and planned in Argentina in the context of a planning federal administration. Not only the old programs in psychotechnics and professional guidance, but also the recommendation during the first Argentine Congress of, of Psychology held in Tucumán adhere to that idea of, 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 of a, a planification economy and a planification policy. The Congress recommends not a program in psychology, but a university program for professional psychologists. In other words, the application of psychology knowledge was emphasis more than psychology Uh, psychological knowledge itself. One of the main topics uh, nowadays uh, when we criticize the psychology education in my country is why our programs only uh, graduate, uh, psych apply psychology and especially, especially clinical psychology. It was in our, in our root, it was, it, it was in the origin, the idea is to, to educate professional psychologists, not no, no psychology. Well, organization of the new uh, program, some characteristic of the revolution that overthrew uh, Peronist. First of all, the proscription of the Peronist party and all of its symbols. It was very important. Uh, Peronist was throughout in, in 1955 and in October in 1955, there, are, there was a couple of states within the revolution and the, the, the position that finally Uh, obtained successful was a position uh, clearly against all the ideas of, of, of Peronism. Prohibition of any worker union activity. Investigation of all members of the Peronist administration by the investigating commission outside the legal courts. Uh, sir, uh, that is, uh, although the, the courts were We are in, 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 in the hands of, of members that we are against the Peronims, it were create the, uh, the uh, investigation commissions near 150 in the whole country to, uh, to investigate all the what, what was called the crime of the state, the crime of the administration uh, past. What changes in university? The presidential decree, uh, 478 of October uh, uh, 14, 1955, declared in commission all the university personnel with the objective to choose professors in the most responsible and fair manner. So, professors who obtained an appointment during Peronese after a public competitive process were dismissed. They will, uh, this professor was uh, known in the country with, uh, with, uh, with, uh, with the name as uh, uh, Flor de Seibo, Seibal Flower, because Fl Fl uh, Seibal Flower was the national flower in Argentina. So they were the, 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 the national professors. 
in, in our country. Another important not only changes in university, but changes in the industry and in the world of work. Incre increasing the average size of industrial company with more than 200 workers, representing 29% in 1945, reached 40% uh, in 1964. Emphasis on what be became known as dynamic industries, that is, industries with a lot of technological development in the iron, steel, petrochemical, rubber, mechanical and car sectors, instead of the traditional industries, food, textile, tobacco, etc. Third, most of these changes were the result of foreign investments and multinational corporations. In 1958, uh, the new foreign investment were of three million dollars. In 1959, 13, six. In 1960, 106, and in 1961, 188 million dollars. Some consequences of all of these changes. Absence of medium and long-term planning uh, policies, at least uh, from the point of view of the federal administration. Of course, they are were, uh, they were uh, planning. Loss of the mediating capacity of administration institutions, especially when appears a clash or conflicts between, uh, between capital and workers. Third, deterioration in the quality of life of broad sectors of, uh, of the population. Four, increase of cultural par pattern of the great metropolis. New literature, renovations in the cinema and in the theater, etc. Modernization of daily life, family planning at the individual level, birth control, the boom of the contraceptive pill, new relationships between genders, and new roles for women. And a last conclusion, but uh, uh, and very important, is the emphasis of on the privacy of people, the subjectivization on human behavior that I will that is, is uh, named in, 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 in nowadays. But um, I try to int introduce here what, what, what role uh, plays psychoanalysis in this modernization. What were the characteristics of this wave of changes with attempted to place a modern industry strongly integrated with foreign capital at the center, not only of economic life, but also of new cultural val values. This is one of the main uh, historians of Argentina, Juan Carlos Portantiero, and then uh, then he, 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 he state, an industrial culture appeared in Argentina during the 60s. The basis for a border advertising system and mass communication system like those in the USA and Europe were developed, and psychoanalysis bears on the scene like an avalanche. That is very important. Psychoanalysis was part of the modernization of the country, of it was part of the falling of the Peronist regime, in, in, in many in many ways relate to Tommy's culture and the and Catholic Church and those appear psychoanalysis like a, like an avalanche. Well, some consequence of this, uh, some author called a discrete revolution was generated that relied on the expansion of the psychotherapy that involved reorientation of subjectivity and intimacy, the circulation of the psychoanalytic Vulgate as Pujol called, family planning based on the split between sexuality and procreation, favored by the widespread of the contraceptive. Well, direct repercussions of psychology. This is a very important book, uh, 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 Orientación Vocacional, Vocational Guidance from Rodolfo uh, Bozlaski. The first uh, repercussion, displacement from professional guidance, especially collective professional guidance, to the model of voca vocational guidance individually and from a clinical perspective. Uh, there what Boulaski, Boulaski distinguished two kinds of approaches of vocational guidance, the actuarial modality and the clinical modality. What is the, the uh, 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 actuarial modality? It's such a dis in place an explicit questioning of psychotechnics, which was like the examen de los ingenios of uh, Guarte de San Juan, uh, he wrote in, 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 in 1575, uh, this actuarial modality connects with the American psychotechnics and the differential psychology of the beginning of the century. 
Another very well-known book, the, the projective techniques and the psychodiagnostic uh, process. Disappearances, the uh, disappearance of psychotechnics. Considered as a whole, as a Taylorist expression by the psychodiagnostic process, psychoanalytically orientated and centered on the individual. Again, Ocampo and Garcia Oceno state the conception of the psychodiagnostic process, as we postulate in this book, is relatively, relatively new. Traditionally, it has been considered from outside as a situation in which the psychologist administrated a test to someone and in those terms formulated the derivation. In this model, the psychologist has worked as someone who learned the best he could to manage a test. Well, so uh, after the, 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 the falling of Peronis and after the introduction of psychoanalysis like an avalanche, appear was I call the four period uh, which is centered in, in, the, in the debate of the role of psychologists, take into account that up this day are, there are no exist in the country psychologists. So one of the main of the main uh, topics in this year was divide what is the role of psychologists, what is similar with psychiatry, what is similar, what is uh, similar with psychoanalysts, what is not. So I call also this period psychoanalytical uh, psychology. Well, since uh, 1961, appear in the whole country a new kind of professional with a degree exclusively in psychology, licenciados or licenciadas in psychology. Public debate about the role of psychology. The first debate is what is a psychology and, and what distinguishes him or her from psychiatrists or psychoanalysts uh, or, or a social worker too. Since the end of, of 60 uh, began uh, and the beginning of the 70, this debate uh, was uh, overla uh, overlapped with a broader political debate on the role of the professional in a society defined as economically and politically dependent and dominated by over indicates of social uh, injustice. Of course, this debate finished dramatically in 1976 uh, uh, before of the of the of the dictatorship uh, headed by General uh, Videla. Well, some initial conclusions to be divided. Sorry, I, I, I stand two minutes. In the early years, authors interested in, interested in psychology focuses the problem of degradation of personality by a set by French psychopathology. Later, in, in the third period, but biased by planning administration, psychology became psychotechnics and professional guidance, especially in universities far from Buenos Aires, Tucumán, Litoral, and Cuyo. Since the organization of the new psychology program, programs at universities, psychoanalysis biased the entire file of psychology. Practitioner psychologists became psychoanalysts, and Freud and later Lacan became the authority patterns. In such a way, main references within any communica communication, certain in clinical topics or uh, centered in clinical topics or not, are mostly Freud and Lacan. And, 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 and for ending, since the 60s, wide dissemination of psychoanalysis, not only in the new programs, but in all the cultural field. It is possible to state that psychology became syn synonymous of psychoanalysis. Professional psychology focused on clinical work and psychotherapy was a success in, 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 uh, since in those years. Epistemological and political rejection of American psychology and from psychology conceived as natural science. Uh, as, you, as, you know, uh, as, as you know, psychology is a very complex uh, discipline with one of his, uh, of, of his uh, bases in natural science, in biology, and the other bases in anthropology and sociology and social science. Uh, in Argentina, uh, was uh, predominate the idea of psychology uh, as a social science, and influence on French thought from Althusser to Lacan and Foucault. Thanks. Thank you very much.